this video explains the foundation marking which is done by Mr. A. Morgan. So this shows the plan of the building which consists of living room and kitchen room. This is the central line marking of a building which shows six number of columns. So this is the site which is chosen and cleaned for marking. The now a base point has been fixed. which is very important for marking so from that base point a base line is being laid using thread and the second point is fixed which is very important for a building marking according to three-fourth method which is very important for marking the formula initiates square root of L square plus B square From the point 1, we are going to mark for 4 feet, a peg has been fixed at the point of 4 feet. Now the change point from the peg which is fixed from 4 feet. five. For a 5 feet, an arc is being made. For a 5 feet, an arc is being marked. Now, the point is being changed at the point 1. For a measurement of 3 feet, an arc is being marked. At that intersection point, an peg is fixed from the point one through the arc a thread has been laid through the arc point a thread is being laid for an approximate distance third point is being fixed Now it forms an L shape for marking it forms an L shape. Now the R points is being removed. From the point 1, a tape is being fixed <coughs> for the measurement of 10 feet, a 
effect is been laid. Now, for the next 10 feet, another peg is being laid, so which totally includes of 20 feet. Now, again from the first point, tape is being fixed. and it is measured for 12 feet the point which is measured for 12 feet from the 12 feet point the tape is being fixed For the distance of 20 feet, a point is being marked and a peg is being fixed. Now the tape is again tilted for tilted and the point is now is being fixed. And the overall measurement shows of around 32 feet. Now, all the pegs are being connected with the thread. Now, at the 12 feet point, the tape has been fixed. For a distance of 10 feet, a peg is being fixed. According to the plan, the footing size pattern is being made. Now, the pattern is fixed at the midpoint of the footing. And using marking powder, the footing is being marked. And this same procedure is repeated for all the columns. So now you can able to see the pattern which is placed at the center point of the footing and using the marking powder it, the footing is being marked likewise all the columns are marked All the six columns are marked, which is shown in the plan. As shown in the plan, all the six columns have been marked. Likewise, all the footing is being marked as shown in the plan using the pattern the pattern is placed in the center so likewise all the columns have been marked Thank <laughs> you.
the pattern is placed at the center point of the footing and then mark now you can able to view the mark footings as per the plan which is shown before so this is the view of the footing so this is the overall view of the footing as per the plan So you can able to see all the six footings. So now we are going to see the front view of the footings marks as per the plan. Thank you.